Ahoy! My name is Robert Olson, and I'm the game designer for SteamWorld Heist 2. I'm excited to show you some of the fantastic mechanics we've been delicately crafting. That you'll use as you lead your crew and sail the great oceanic sea shark. Let's start with the gunplay. Just like in the first game, the combat of SteamWorld Heist 2 is turn-based and you play through missions where you scrap bots, collect loot and try to get out alive. And yes, the bullets bounce. Ricochet your shots of walls, ceilings and even other robots to outwit your foes and pull off amazing trick shots. But it's not just about the firepower. The other robots who inhabit this shard come in all different parts and sizes. Some will aid you and your team on your journey. Recruit them to your crew and use our all new job system to assign roles and abilities. As the captain, it's up to you to fine tune their abilities for optimal performance. The weapons you equip your crewmates with decide what job they have. Each job has different weapons and abilities, enabling a multitude of different playstyles. Good luck hiding from a sniper's eye. Their laser-sighted weapons show their projectile's path, leaving no faraway hiding space safe. Flankers bolt across any level, and there's none other as skilled at picking up loot. Fast on their feet and carrying powerful shotguns, enemies better watch their backs. Brawlers break baddies with huge hammers. With thick armor plates and the ability to heal after scrapping foes, stopping is not a part of their program. The forward-thinking engineer both weakens their enemies and supports their teammates. Healing, creating cover and setting up combos, they got it all. And hey, they always get to shoot twice. Boomers blow big groups of enemies to bits. But boomers aren't one-trick robo-ponies. Who, who wrote this script? They have a special knack for equipping and using banging utility items. Reapers are lethal, but reckless. Whenever they scrap an enemy, they get to shoot again. But watch out, their thirst for mayhem might get their frail frames into difficult situations. The abilities you unlock by completing missions with a specific job stay with your characters, even if they switch jobs in the future. For example, increase the precision of your boomer with the accuracy of the sniper. Combine the speed of the flanker with the toughness of a brawler. You get the point. Create specialized builds by combining job abilities with your character's personal upgrades. And with all of the utility items and unique weapons, the possibilities are endless. The vast oceanic shard is filled with high-pressure threats and challenges, such as the diesel-driven Royal Navy. Their playstyle is more defensive. Drones, snipers, turrets and guards who can charge through just about anything. There are also commanders to apply edicts that powers up nearby navy units. So you better scrap them first. In the bolt chilling north, you'll encounter rattlers. A cult of bone-obsessed bots that roam across Arctica. These cultists maniacally replace their metallic parts with bone. This makes them simple targets to scrap individually. But don't get cocky you can easily become overwhelmed when a swarm of them spawn in. The seas of Steel Heist 2 are teeming full of steambots both friendly and deadly. So gear up, lock and load, and get ready for the heist of a lifetime in Steel World Heist 2. Keep an eye out for the next feature video, where we will be diving deeper into the characters and story of SteamWorld Heist 2. Until then, 
I wish you fair winds, steamates. <laughs>